This is Women's History Month. I rise to recognize Nella Larson, who was born in Chicago in 1891. Her mother was a Danish immigrant and her father an immigrant from the Danish West Indies, what's now known as the U.S. Virgin Islands. Larson attended school in all white environments in Chicago until she moved to Nashville to attend high school. She later practiced nursing, served as a librarian in the New York Public Library, and after resigning from this position, she began a literary career. Her first novel, Quicksand, which won her a Harmon Foundation bronze medal, and after the publication of her second novel, Passing, in 1929, Larson was awarded the first Guggenheim Fellowship for an African-American woman, establishing her as a premier novelist of the Harlem Renaissance. She died in New York in 1964. Her work explored the complex issues of racial identity and identification in the fiction. Though critics remain conflicted about her novels, Quicksand and Passing, there can be no question that they are significant, groundbreaking American literary texts. She received a number of awards for her writing in 1930s and throughout. Along with her contemporary novelist, Zora Neale Hurston, Larson is considered to be one of the most important female voices in the Harlem Renaissance. We remember her voice now. I yield back.